Hello everyone, this is Al Red Sox Fan coming to you from Al Red Sox Fan YouTube channel. Hope all is well. And we're going to continue with overtime in our ASG Classic Soccer Mega Europe Mega European Cup 1. The 1966 England national team that won the World Cup, taking on the 1982 Italian national team that won the World Cup. 90 minutes decided nothing. 0-0 zero, zero score. Unfortunately, when I set up the match, I must have made a mistake. We did not go to overtime. I have set this up as a tournament game, so there will be overtime. But whoever scores first, as we're playing with the golden goal rule, the game's over. The game is over. So this will be the overtime played out. Yellow cards have been eliminated because we had to start a new game. Whoever scores first wins. We're in overtime. The golden goal rule and then once again, we will give you the lineups for the 1966 English National Football Team, soccer in America. Peters, Greaves, Hunt up front. They're playing a 3-3-4. Bobby, Charlton, Hurst, Styles in the midfield. And the back four, Wilson, Jackie, Charlton, Bobby Moore, and Cohen. Gordon Banks was outstanding in regulation. as he stopped many a shot upon him. For the Azzurri, the Italians, Graziani and Rossi up front, Antognoni, Tardelli, Marini, and Conti at the midfield, in the back, Cabrini, Calavati, Sierra, and Gentili. Dino Zoft is in net. Thank you to our good friend MV, Mouse in the House, to give me some pronunciations. Again, this is overtime. First goal wins. If we do go to kicks, we'll go to kicks. But it will be two full halves before we go to kicks. Because again, I set this up as a tournament. Because the first game, we obviously I obviously set up incorrectly and we didn't go to overtime. So nothing, nothing. We head to overtime. I will be playing as the Azzurri, the Italian national soccer team. Greaves will kick off. We're at Wembley. At least we should be at Wembley. Well, I might have messed that up. But here we... No, it is Wembley. All right, Greaves to kick off for England. There's the whistle. Ball in play to Hearst. The Italians will get back on defense. Hurst in possession for England. We go to work rate. It's Bobby Charlton and Conti. There's a battle for the ball, and Bobby Charlton wins it. Sends a pass to Hurst. England looking for the kill, looking to win this in overtime. Bobby Charlton has it, and Tognoni challenges him, and he comes away with the ball. The Italians go on the counterattack, and Tognoni plays it out to Tardelli, and Bobby Charlton... Gets the ball away. Bobby Charlton, what's he going to do? He's going to put a shot on net. Just outside the box. And he sails it wide of Dino Zoft. It will be a gold kick. Oh, the fans here at Wembley, they thought they had a winner. Zoft with the goal kick. We want a low roll here. 61, there's going to be a battle at midfield. And Bobby Charlton wins it. Bobby's all over the place. For the Lion of England. Charlton starts the offense. He's going to make an aggressive run down mid-pitch. Charlton head up. Still looking to create. Passes it to his brother Jackie. Marini for the Italians. Will put a challenge on him. And Marini with a beautiful hard slide tackle. Comes away with the ball. The Italians go on the counterattack. But yet we're going to play it back. Dino Zoff catches it. He'll put it down, and he will strike the ball forward. It's a goal kick by Zoff, and Kalovati has it near mid-pitch. 
The Italians looking for space and to create. Here is the buildup by the Azzurri. Kalovati will keep it himself on a short run. 86 and under. It's a 71. Kalovati still in possession of the ball. The English defense trying to cut off the angles and space for the Italians. Kalovati continues on the short run. Peters with the challenge. And Peters has it for the English national team. Counterattack by England. Italy goes back on defense. Peters will make an aggressive run. 71 and under. Peters makes the run. Gentili comes in. Good job by Gentili. Cutting Peters off. The Italians go on the counterattack here in overtime. And they're going to try to spring a long pass out to the wing. 67 and under. It's a good pass to Antononi. He's on the wing. Antognoni passes to Cabrini. Cabrini continues to come down the wing. Cabrini will keep it himself. A short run. Cabrini trying to create space. Again will keep it himself. Just barely a successful short run. As 87, we just got an 86. Cabrini... Short pass, 81. It's a good pass into the corner. Paolo Rossi has it. Paolo Rossi looking for the cross. It's a good cross. Graziani can put it away and win the game for the Italians. Graziani shoots, and it's wide. Oh, Graziani with a golden opportunity shoots wide. Big miss by the Italians. It was a beautiful cross by Paolo Rossi. Gordon Banks with the goal kick now. Italians go back in defense. That's a hell of a goal kick on that 13. And Cohen has it in beautiful position in the Italian sector for England. Cohen, it's going to be an aggressive run. He's challenged, but he gets by. Cohen sends the pass to Wilson. Cabrini comes in and steals it. The Italians have possession. A stout defense by both these teams. But to me, the star of the game right now would be Gordon Banks, the English goalkeeper. So Cabrini has it. The Italians go on an aggressive counterattack here. Cabrini will make a short run. Sends it to the middle of the pitch on his run. Cabrini looking to pass it off, but now he will keep it himself. That's the best option. Cabrini taking it to the wing, as I have obviously going to the outside. Cabrini will go short pass over to Gentili. Gentili, the defender on the wing. Gentili will go short pass. And he kicks it out of play. Was it off the English defense? We'll find out in a second. And no, it's going to be an England throw-in. They might have the Italians off guard. Throw-in. What a throw-in to Bobby Moore. Bobby Moore, the Italians race back on defense. Bobby Moore looking for a short pass. Cabrini comes in. That is a hard foul. There is a whistle. There is a whistle. But no card. Alan Griggy has joined us for a different kind of football. Hope all is well, Alan Griggy. No Diego Maradona in this game. The hand of God, Diego Maradona. One of the worst calls in soccer history to beat England in Italy. Uh, what was that, the 80, 82, 86? Was it the 86 World Cup in Italy or the 90? It was horrible. He handed the ball into the net. How they missed that is beyond me, and that beat England. Indirect kick for Bobby Charlton. Again, he wants a low roll here. Charlton lofts it into the box. It's a 50-50 ball. Shiera, and Shiera wins it. That is a big win by the Azzurri in the box. Saving the day for the moment is Shiera. The Italians go on offense. And that ball is going to go out. So Grieve got the ball. Attempted to put it on Dino Zoft on net. But it was blocked by Shiera. Now it is a dangerous corner kick for England. We are in overtime. As the game went to regulation in our first video. Bobby Charlton places it. The Italians line up their defense in the box. 
It's the corner. Looking for the low roll. A 44. Pretty good corner kick by Bobby Charlton. Peters has it. Will he win it for England? Here's the shot. Save chart. Zoff bats it away. Calavati trying to clear the box for the Italians. Calavati will make a run himself. And he gets it out of the box. Calavati controls. Italy dodge the bullet there. They go on offense now. Calavati will keep it. He's coming down center pitch. That was the best option. The defender, Calavati. And now he's going to send a short pass out wide. We need an 88 and under. It's a 70. Calavati sends it to Cabrini, his fellow defender. Cabrini on the wing. Cabrini will keep it. He's going to go. Oh, and Hunt comes in quite hard and takes Cabrini right off his feet, nearly decleating him. There is no card, though. Cabrini with the indirect kick. There's a little pushing and shoving. Things are getting testy here in overtime. The next goal wins. As this is our continuation from our first video. Here's the indirect kick by Cabrini. That's a six. There's going to be a battle for this ball. And Calavati wins it. Italy has it in the English sector. The Azzurri. Can they put one past the great Gordon Banks? They have not been able to do so as of yet. Calavati, the defender, will go on a short run. Head up, trying to create space. He's going to take a shot from distance to try. Maybe we get a corner kick, a set piece. Calavati, a decent shot. Save chart. Deflected by Moore and out. Italy has the corner kick that we wanted. Conti places the ball down. Paolo Rossi in the box. Can Paolo Rossi or Graziani get a good corner from Conti and put it past the iron wall, the steel cage known as Gordon Banks? So far with Gordon Banks, none shall pass. Conti's ready for the corner kick. We want a low roll. That's a 0-6. It's going to be a great opportunity for the Italians. Cabrini, can he put it past? He's going to head it. Oh, he headed it wide. Oh, Cabrini, the championship laid upon the noggin of Cabrini, and he headed it wide of net. Gordon Banks quickly pulled his hands back. It will be a goal kick for England. Banks puts the ball down. The Italians get back on defense. Here's the goal kick. That's a 41. Plays it to Charlton, Jackie Charlton, in the English sector. Jackie Charlton. Is going for a long pass down the middle to Bobby Moore. Bobby Moore for the Lion. He's going to make an aggressive run. He's getting challenged by Shiera. And Shiera takes the ball away. The Italians quickly go on the counterattack here in overtime. The golden goal rule. Shiera. Long pass wide. 69 and under. It's a 66. He plays it to Cabrini. The defender, Cabrini, on the wing, will try to make a short run. 92 and under, a good roll, 34. Cabrini controls. The Italians with the buildup, looking for space so that they can create a game-winning goal. Oh, God, they're playing it back. Why do the Italians do this? Cabrini to Antagragni. And Cohen comes in, takes the ball away. Quick little pass to Bobby Charlton. Driving down the wing. He shoots and it is blocked by Shiera. Good job by Shiera, but it will be a very dangerous set piece now as Hunt will take the corner kick for England. Will the Lion roar with a game-winning goal? The Italians get back on defense. Hunt with the corner kick. Looking for a low roll. 36. A decent corner kick. There's a battle in the box. Jackie Charlton. This could be it. Blocked. Shiera blocks it. Marini comes away in the box. Marini comes away in the box. Jackie Charlton nearly won it. He beat Dino Zoft. But guarding the post was Shiera. 
He saved the day for the Azuri. Marini in possession. What's the best option for Marini? He will try to take it out of the box himself on a short run. And he does. The Italians breathe a sigh of relief as they try to regroup. Marini still in possession. Marini will keep it on a short run. Head up looking to pass. And he will send it out wide. Short pass. 88 and under. It's a good pass to Antagnoni, the midfielder. Midfielder left. Antagnoni will keep it himself. He'll make a run down the wing. Antagnoni again will keep it. One heck of a run by Antagnoni. England falling back in defense, and Antagnoni just keeps coming forward. But Cohen stops it right there, and now a very hard tackle, but no card. No card. So Antagnoni will get the indirect kick. Places the ball down. Idli hoping for that golden goal. Plays it to Marini on the indirect kick. Marini at mid-pitch for the Azuri. Marini will keep it himself. Marini on the run. Italy looking for space. Plays it out wide to Antononi. And now it's a midfield battle with Styles and Conti. Styles has it. Will we challenge 10%, 23% chance? Yellow, no, we will not. Styles wins the day on a very bad pass by the Azuri. The Italians get back on defense. Styles plays it to mid-pitch to Hurst. Gentili comes in and steals the ball. The Italians will try to spring a quick counterattack. And we're going to... Oh, why do we play it back? Hurst intercepts the pass. And they have the Italians at a disadvantage here. Hurst plays it out to Jackie Charlton. But Conti, the midfielder, saves the day for the Azuri. The Azuri will now kill a little bit of time. Conti keeps it himself. Takes it close to mid-pitch. Conti, we're going to look for a long pass here, hopefully. Long pass, 62 and under. It's a through ball! And what a pass by Conti! It's a through ball! This could be it! Paulo Rossi has it! England playing the onside trap! The flag doesn't go... Oh! At the last second, the flag goes up. Offsides Italy. The onside trap played to perfection by England. As Paolo Rossi was going to break in free on Gordon Banks. But what a beautiful job by the defensive wall of England. They played that offside traps to perfection. As they came forward and Rossi was offside. So an indirect kick. For England, 22 minutes gone by in overtime. Moore will take it. It's Bobby Moore. That's a five. And a good kick. Hurst has it for the Lion of England. Hurst plays it center pitch to Moore. And Conti takes it away. But Styles is going to challenge Conti. Conti, with a nifty move, gets around Styles. The Italians on the counterattack. Overtime. Golden goal rule. Conti will keep it himself. 90 and under. It's a 99. Hurst takes it away from Conti. And now it's England's turn to counterattack. The Italians frantically get back in defense. Hurst with an aggressive run. Looking for some space. Hurst sends the pass to Styles. Cabrini will challenge Styles with a slide tackle. Styles gets around Cabrini. What a nice move by Styles. Breaking in on the box is Styles. Antognoni comes in hard. And it's a yellow card for Antognoni. A dangerous, dangerous indirect kick now for Bobby Charlton in England. They are about. 40 yards out. Here's the indirect kick. So he cannot put it on net. He must send it to another 
English player. And they play it into the box. Peters has it. Point blank range on Dino Zoff. Will England win? Here's the shot. Oh, Shiera once again saves the day for the Azuri. As he heads it out over the bar, it will be a set piece for England, a corner kick, and it's Bobby Charlton placing the ball down. He will take the corner. The Italians and the English jostling in the box for a position. Here's the corner kick for Bobby Charlton. 73. And Calavatti knocks it out of the box. Controlling it, though, for England is Styles. England starts the build-up all over again in the Italian sector. Styles will keep it himself. He'll make an aggressive run, but Calavatti comes in hard and stops it. No card. English did not like that call. The fans here at Wembley did not like that call. They wanted to see a card on Calavatti. Bobby Charlton places it down. Another indirect kick in the Italian sector. 76. He's going to put that high into the box. There's a battle in the box. It's Hurst and Conti, a 50-50 ball, and Conti wins it. Good job by the midfielder. The Italian's in control. Conti will look to take it out of the box himself. 90. Oh! Bobby Charlton steals it! This could be it! Charlton shoots! And Zoft with the save! Great reaction by Dino Zoft. He has not been challenged much, but he was challenged there as Bobby Charlton, with his hands on his face, almost won the Mega European Cup for England. Instead, the Azuri fans breathe a sigh of relief. Dino Zoff places it for a gold kick. 89. That is not a good goal kick. Greaves wins the battle at midfield. And Marini comes in hard to stop any type of counterattack. 26.50 gone by in overtime. Bobby Charlton with another indirect kick. The Italians will go back on defense. Charlton looking for a low roll. That's an 11. That is a good indirect kick. Charlton gets it to Moore. Bobby Moore looking for the short pass. Gets it to Hurst. That's a nice pass. He zipped it between Italian defenders. There's some space here for Hurst. What will Hurst do with it? Hurst sends it into the box. Hunt has it. Hunt's going to take the shot. This could be it. Zoff looking for the save. And he knocks it away. A diving attempt. Ball loose in the box. Conti has it for Italy. The Italians will go on the counterattack. Conti. Deep ball. He's got Graziani. He's got Graziani. Graziani. Charlton is going to go for the tackle. Graziani gets around Charlton. Graziani's still in possession. He's going to take a short run here, 80 and under. Graziani. Looking for Paolo. Oh, Hurst comes in. Quite hard. There's the whistle. No card. Conti will come up. Indirect kick for Conti. About 45 yards out. Gordon Banks setting the defense. The English goalkeeper. Can the Italians win it here? 30 minutes and 20 seconds have gone by in overtime. 57. It's lofted into the box. It's Paolo Rossi and Bobby Moore battling for the ball. Paolo Rossi wins it for the win. Paolo Rossi shoots. Gordon. And Paolo Rossi is wide. Oh, he had Gordon, but he was wide with the shot. And England dodges the peripheral bullet on that one. We are still scoreless, 30 minutes and 40 seconds into overtime. Gordon Banks, Gordon Banks places it down 
for the goal kick. Banks takes a few steps back. The Italians go back to play defense. Banks has had a lot of good goal kicks here. 76. This will not be one of them as Calavati wins it just over the mid-pitch line. And now the Italians will launch their attack one more time. Can this be the, the attack that gives them the golden goal? Short pass by Calavati. He sends it over to Marini, the midfielder. Marini looking for some space. Marini will go short pass, 82 and under. It's an 81. They just get it through to Graziani. Graziani will put the shot on net from distance. Graziani puts it right on net. Oh, he sails it over. The leaping Gordon Banks quickly brought his arms down. He did not want a corner kick. And again, it is a goal kick. The Italians were looking for a set piece possibility. But now it is a goal kick by Gordon Banks, the English goalkeeper. 13, an excellent goal kick. Mid-pitch, Italian sector. Hurst comes down with it. Hurst is going to keep it himself. Hurst makes a little short run, looking for space. Sierra comes in. Steals it, sends it to Conti. Conti. But Jackie Charlton quickly stops the counterattack and takes Marini. I think it was Marini right off his face. Actually, could have been Conti. Marini will take the indirect kick. Back and forth they go. We are in overtime. A continuation from our first video. 33-50 gone in overtime. First goal wins. Golden goal rule. Here's Marini with the... And do we want Marini? No. Let's go... <clears throat> Let's go Conti. Conti will take the indirect kick. 87. Horrible indirect kick, but somehow it gets to Marini. Marini in possession for the Azuri. Marini will go on a short run. It's a good roll of 75. Marini... Again, the Italians looking for space. Marini will send the pass out wide. 87 and under. It's a good pass. And he works it to the midfielder left. Antognoni. Antognoni. On the wing. He'll keep it himself. He'll make a short run. He's going to put the shot on net. Antognoni from distance. A decent shot. But it's going to curl wide. Again, looking for a possible set piece, the Italians. And once again, Gordon Banks will put it down for a gold kick. 35 minutes and 10 seconds gone in overtime. Here's Banks with the gold kick. There's a battle. Calavati wins it. Greaves comes in hard. There will be no quick counterattack by the Italians as the English team takes a calculated risk to stop it. Good job by Greaves. Tardelli... With the indirect kick. The Italians come forward. We are in overtime. 30, 36 minutes gone by. Tardelli sends it to Graziani. The attacker. Graziani in possession. Graziani on a short run. It's a good run by Graziani. Graziani trying to get a little closer. As England retreats into defense. Graziani 80 and under. Another good. That's a 16. Graziani looking for options here. Now it's work rate. He plays it back to Antononi and Peters and Antognoni. It's a foul on Antognoni. As the Italians were looking for space, they played it back and once again it bites them in the ass. Bobby Charlton with the indirect kick. The Italians come back to form their defense. Indirect kick for Bobby Charlton. 78. Plays it short to his brother Jackie. So Jackie Charlton in possession. Jackie Char Charlton looking for a short pass. 77 and under. And it's intercepted by Antagnoni. He anticipated the give and go. The Italians come up on offense. Antagnoni. He's going to look to pass it short out wide. 87 and under. It's a bad pass and Jackie Charlton returns the favor. Jackie Charlton on the wing after 
He anticipates it. The Italians come back on defense. Jackie Charlton trying to spring a quick counterattack with a long pass. And of course it's a 20. He plays it to Moore. Bobby Moore. Moore on the keep. Good run by Bobby Moore. The Italians retreat in defense trying to cut off the angles. England looking for space to create that golden goal in overtime. Moore to keep again. 79 and under. Moore about 30 yards outside the box. Moore making one more run. He's just outside the box. The Italians must challenge him now. Moore trying to get in the box. And Colavati challenges him and takes the ball away. Colavati saves the day for the Azzurri. We're at 39 minutes into overtime. The Italians in possession. No goal in the regulation. And now so far, no goal in overtime. It's the golden goal rule. First score, first win. Kalavati has it. And he's going to play it out wide. Short pass, 89 and under. He plays it to Antognoni on the wing. Antognoni will keep it himself short run, 90 and under. It's a 77. Oh, it's a good run. It's a good run by Antognoni. He'll keep it again as he races down the wing. Antognoni will keep it again, 90 and under. Antognoni, he keeps it. Near mid pitch, looking for options. And the best option is for him to continue this run down the wing. England trying to cut him off and keep the space limited. Antognoni is going to keep it again, 89 and under. He's making one hell of a run. Looking for Paolo Rossi or Graziani, the attackers. Now we go to the X chart, 52 and a 1. Antognoni, Bobby Charlton finally stops the advance. What a hell of a defensive play by Bobby Charlton of England. The Lion roared on that. Now it's the Italians' turn to get back on defense. Back and forth they go. Charlton plays it short to Cohen. And Tononi comes back and takes the ball away. Short pass out wide, 80 and under. It's a bad pass. The Italians with a bad pass there. Good an anticipation by Hunt of England. Hunt plays it short to Cohen. And again, Antognoni comes in. But now Cohen's going to challenge him. A 50-50 ball. Antononi spins around him. Italy in possession. Italy on the counter. Long pass out wide. 61 and under. It's a 31. He plays it to Cabrini, the defender. Cabrini looking for the cross. It's a beautiful cross. Oh, Jackie Charlton. It could be an own goal. The game's over! Jackie Charlton tries to deflect the cross! And it goes into the back of the net! And Italy has won! Mega European Cup won on an own goal by Jackie Charlton! Oh my god! Oh my god! You gotta feel sick for Jackie Charlton as he... Actually puts it past his own goalkeeper. And this game is over. The Azuri, who could not put one past Gordon Banks. A beautiful cross. Jackie Charlton went battling in the defense. As the ball was going into Paolo Rossi, he deflected it. And it went right by Gordon Banks into the back of the English net. And the Italians win 1-0 on an own goal. So Italy takes Mega European Cup 1, 1-0. One the 1982 Italian national team defeats the 1966 English national team. Both teams won the World Cup that year. And you got to feel very, very sick to your stomach for that poor man, Jackie Charlton.
an own goal gives the opposing Azuri the cup. And there is our continuation of our first video that went scoreless in regulation. So Italy wins it on an own goal. I'd like to thank Keith White, Dave Gardner, Alan Griggy, C&D TV. Check out that wonderful channel. Our good friend Tony Porter. Don't forget Dave Gardner. Very close to 1,000 subs. And Digital Dice on Spreaker or wherever fine podcasts can be listened to. Wow. An own goal. And there is no consoling Jackie Charlton. Italy celebrates the victory. Unbelievable finish to an unbelievable game. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate your time. Again, this was a continuation from our first video in which I did not set it up properly, so we did not have overtime. We started a new game. We made it a tournament game, so I made sure there'd be overtime. And I told at the beginning, whoever scores the first goal, because we were playing with the golden goal rule, the game is over. And unfortunately, England scored the first goal, but it was into their own net, an own goal by Jackie Charlton. And his brother is trying to console him along with his teammates, but there is no consoling Jackie. Maybe time will heal those wounds. So thank you very much. Greatly appreciate your time. Stay safe. Be smart. Um, God bless. Italy wins 1-0 on an own goal by England. They take Mega European Cup 1. You know what else is coming. What's coming? Peace!